folks, Matt from Art of the Image. We've got the Canon 80D here. We've got it on our standard vlogging rig. We've got it on the Gorillapod Focus with the Ballhead X. We're using the Rode Video Mic. We're gonna take it into the Antique Mall. We're gonna do a vlog style video. Show you how the 80D performs as a vlogging camera. Got a Coke display here. Some interesting Coca-Cola products. Check it out, I found an old Kodak Readymatic 500. Pretty neat. Comes with the case and everything. And then up above here, it looks like an old Kodak, or I shouldn't say Kodak, it looks like an old Polaroid camera right there. Check out the old record player. I've had the idea for a while now to take one of these, strip out the guts, and put in a nice MP3 system, perhaps with a uh, Bluetooth wireless speaker. I think it'd look pretty cool. When I see these old uh, type of antique looking walls with these uh, plaques and woodworking on them, it makes me think it'd be a big great backdrop for doing portraits or uh, any type of uh, of portrait work, maybe with kids. Just has an interesting look to it. Check it out, found another Polaroid camera. This one is a Polaroid Color Pack 2. Looks kinda neat, they want 18 bucks for it. Found some more old cameras. These are brownies, looks like a three pack. Two of them are brownies anyways. Not sure what the other one beside it is. I'm heading up to the second floor now, and uh, the one thing I'm noticing with the ADD on the Gorillapod is I'm uh, gonna have to do a little more working out because uh, it takes a little bit of uh, arm strength to hold up the ADD with the Rode video mic on top of it on the Gorillapod Focus. And um, I don't know, we'll see I guess how good the IS on this lens is. Found a Kodak Duoflex 3 right here on the shelf. Looks pretty interesting. We'll get a couple shots of that. It's an old camera. Another couple of camera finds here. We got an old Bell and Howell projector. Then we got an old Polaroid camera. Check it out, I found Castle Grayskull. When I was a kid, I wanted one of these things so bad, I'm almost tempted to buy this right now. You gotta love some of the interesting shots you find here. I love this uh, crane or pelican or whatever it is, but uh, with the background blown out here of this painting, makes for a really neat shot. That is one handsome looking painting, or should I say one handsome looking lady in the painting. Handheld here, zooming in manually, maybe a little shaky, but uh, you gotta get a close up of this face. Check it out, I found the king. Hunka hunka burning love. Found the mannequins. There they are over there. Gotta have the mannequins in the video every time. They just look cool. There's something about video with mannequins in it. It's almost like we're starting to film a horror movie. This is another one of those situations where we've got the uh, look behind us that I keep thinking will be great for portraits. We've got like this old timber look here on the walls, these boards. It's like sheaths of uh, cut tree, cut uh, logs, and it just has that really not neat look. It looks like uh, something in a barn and we've got the old furniture here. Looks like a great spot to take some portraits. You know, one of the things that's really good about the Canon 80D is the battery life. 
you don't find yourself having to change batteries very often in comparison to some of the other cameras I've used that have smaller batteries. The LP E6Ns in here really seem to last a good while. That said, this one's almost done, but this is I think the third shoot I've been on on one charge, so I better kill the video here and uh, throw another battery in. Other than getting used to the weight of this thing and holding it, the Gorillapod Focus and the Ballhead X has been really great with the Canon 80D and uh, combined with the Rode mic, which I'll be interested to hear myself when you hear this video, uh, it's making a great vlogging camera. The Dual Pixel AF is really working well and I'm really liking the Canon 80D here as a vlogging camera. If you want to take a look at any of the full-size JPEGs out of uh, the Canon 80D, I'm going to throw them up on the Flickr channel. I'll put the link below so you can see them on Flickr. I'll also put the tags if you're in the neighborhood here at Woodstock, in Woodstock. You can check out the antique mall here and uh, check out some of these neat uh, antiques and uh, photo options yourself. That concludes our vlogging test of the Canon 80D here at the Antique Mall in Woodstock. If you want to check out the Antique Mall, it's here in Woodstock at 97 Wilson Street. That's Woodstock, Ontario. Lots of neat stuff to see in here. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at ArtOfTheImage.com.